Unit 5. Job Satisfaction. Track 4. A recent survey rated Procter & Gamble as one of the best workplaces in the UK. How do you encourage job satisfaction among your staff? I think attracting, retaining and motivating employees is, is key to any successful business. And that's core of how you drive job satisfaction. At Procter & Gamble, I think we achieve this really in, in two main ways. The first way is that we seek to be a business that's committed to its people. Most of our leaders of the organisation have grown up through the organisation, so they know it very well. They've come through individual, personalised career paths and development plans, committed to invest in them as they've developed their careers with us. We reward and recognise people individually as a company for their individual contributions, not as a group or as a, as, as a total, but individually, driving their connection to what they work on, to the reward and recognition that they get. Diversity and celebrating difference of people is another core principle by which we operate. Recognising that great innovation comes from diversity, we seek to make this part of what we call our DNA in our company. So I think it's commitment to people. But beside that, we also focus on challenging our people. People need to be challenged to drive job satisfaction. We are in a very tough marketplace. We operate in the fast-moving consumer goods uh, arena, and this drives constant challenge and, and dynamic change. Our consumers are very demanding. They constantly want new products, new ideas that are going to improve their lives, which is company purpose. So our people are constantly challenged to come up with new innovation, new ideas, and build ever stronger and better customer relationships and supplier relationships. So I think through two-pronged approach of committed to people and driving challenging opportunities for them has driven our job satisfaction.